Well, that's an important question because it it is a huge issue, and and we we do seem to need a mass movement of people ready to make a fundamental change. There are two, though, very good reasons why it makes sense to focus on specific achievable goals and develop direct action campaigns and get after those goals one at a time. I think uh, one reason to do a very targeted campaign that has an achievable goal, which uh, the eliminating mountaintop removal is an achievable goal, I believe, is to be able to get something done. And then people can look at this and say, oh my gosh, we got something done. It reminds me of Gandhi's situation. When he went back home to India after South Africa, he found a population similar to ours, fairly hopeless, fairly passive. And he found that he needed to do campaign after specific campaign on locatable and specific goals before he could arouse people's sense of passion and hope so that they would take on the big one, which in his case was the British Empire. And the other reason is because there's been a lack, a, a loss of skills since the 60s and the 70s when there was a wide number of people in the U.S. who knew how to organize highly effective and strategic campaigns for change. We don't have the skill set in the population for bringing about the degree of change that's necessary to take on climate change and therefore I think we need to build those skills and the way to build the skills is through accomplishable, achievable, concrete, specific campaigns. That's the, that, it's that kind of campaign that gives you the feedback that you need in order to develop a craft and what we need is a craft in social change that enables us to take on the biggie.